The great King Casimir sent us to stop Angoth. Well said. But we can't just rush after the villain. First off, Angoth's toxic mist protects the approach to Kath Badro. We have to chance it. We don't have any other options. A squad of dragons succumbed to the mist before they could retreat. I hope the soldiers still live. That mist is deadly. And that fool from Camlord, what was he thinking? He charged right into the mist after them. They couldn't have gotten too far into the graveyard. The poison mist acts fast. Hopefully, they stay together. With the city liberated from Fal Chu, some of the Camlord guard came up this way looking for a fight. A noble named Darien was acting as their leader. RK blind me if I know. When the king mentioned your name, the dog perked up and stuck with us all the way from Daggerfall. Looks like he's happy to see you. Look who's here. I should have known you'd be making Angoff's life miserable. Camlorn wasn't enough for you, eh? I wish I knew. I didn't think. I just rushed in to help the Dragon Knights. My guards started gasping and falling to the ground, just like the Knights. But not me. The mist is thicker toward the gate. They won't survive passing through it again. But the mist doesn't seem to affect the Necromancers. Those amulets must protect them. Kill a few. Take their amulets, and give them to the knights. Better grab a couple of extras, just in case anyone shows up while you're gone. These soldiers won't last much longer, and I don't have enough magic to extend my ward to protect them. Perfect. Thank you. 
I'll put them on the wounded knights, and Darien can lead them to safety. Do you have any more? I might be able to use them to clear the mist. If I merge them and cast an amplification spell, I can increase the size of my protection ward. Good. Meet me at the center of the graveyard. When I... takes care of the mist, but who knows for how long. This next bit is critical. I've seen what you can do, so I know you're up to it. You won't be able to just walk into Angoff's parlor and challenge him to a duel. He has minions. His kind always has minions. I'll follow you as soon as the soldiers get here. Oh, even better. Take this binding stone. Find a secure location inside the catacombs and use it to call me to you. Some of the dead were protected by wards designed to prevent desecration. Look for a tomb with these wards and use the stone there. Good. You found the perfect spot for... Wait. Yes. Sir Lannis and his knights volunteered to come with me. But I only see Dame Alexine. Good. But listen. There's only one way to get out of these crypts. You have to kill Angoff. Fancy meeting you here. Tavern, I said. Meet me in a tavern. There's no ale down here. Just zombies and tentacles. And where are the serving wenches? You promised me serving wenches. Oh well, at least your timing is perfect. Dear Gabrielle's spell seems to have misfired. Luckily, a few of us were able to find each other. Three locks protect Angoff's inner sanctum. I doubt that even you can get in there by simply knocking. I wish I could aid you, but I'm needed here. Lannis is good with a sword, but I'm better. I'll protect the survivors. I don't know exactly, but the Bloodthorn cultists told me about the Guardians. All I know is that Angoff drew on the collected power of his cultists to summon the creature. Actually, I couldn't get anything out of the cultist about the trap. Sorry, you're on your own with that one. It seems that when Angoff first came to power, a certain knight took offense and tried to kill him. Wizard Benelay said you'd gotten inside and were hunting Angoff. We wanted to help, but I hope we haven't done more harm than good. We met Wizard Benelay outside. She said you'd use a binding stone to call us. Then suddenly we were down here in the dark and surrounded by a horde of undead. My best guess? Deeper inside the catacombs.
Lady the Eight, never creep up on a person you're likely to get beheaded. You're the mad fool who went into the catacombs ahead of us, aren't you? I'll head out as soon as I see a clear path. A word of warning, though. The lurcher in the chamber ahead is extremely tough. I'd keep it away from the totems surrounding it if you plan to challenge it. Stay back. This area's trapped. Don't get caught like I did. After each trap fires, there's a brief moment when you can disarm. So, I'm not the only one left? That's good to hear.
are the one who wishes to destroy my master. I know what you seek. I would tell you if I could, but instead I must thwart you. The shard key is bound to my spirit, as surely as I am bound to guard it. But I wonder, will you listen to a riddle? A useful riddle? What cannot be said directly may be hinted at. Listen then. Rot and death are Angoff's guise. Living flesh holds his demise. I must release the shard to the one who brings me what the living flesh beyond this crypt holds. I cannot say directly. Only through riddle. Seek what differs in the next room. Take what the living flesh holds, then unbind me with it. That spirit. His gaze. So hard and cold. They're here? That's great news. I'll go find them in a moment. But be careful around this spirit. I think he's cursed me already. I'll tell him. Watch yourself down there. Angoff has the entire place rigged with traps. to destroy my master? I know- Yes, but take care what you say. The words must be repeated exactly as written. Oh, it's done! Thanks, Stendar. Here, take the shard key. I am free to ascend at last. Destroy Angoff. Avenge me and the others that have fallen victim to his crimes. We'll do what we can to help. Just stay away from his vines. So you are the vain fool who seeks to fly Glenumbra from my grasp.
Wherever you go, get to the light before his magic destroys you. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? All right, maybe fun isn't the right word, but you were glorious. Angoff is finally dead. We can't thank you enough for what you've done. The others have all collapsed in their tents. They're exhausted, but I wanted to welcome you back. And Sir Lannis wants to talk to you. Who knows? Maybe he wants to give you a medal or something. Well, go on. We'll be fine. I promise. I suppose I could use another... The king will be grateful for what we've done here. Some of Angoff's minions are still running loose, but it's nothing we can't handle. Without Angoff's magic, hopefully the vines will wither and die. Yes, but I can't put my finger on it. We've heard rumblings that things up north aren't looking any better. I hear there's trouble in Koglin village. Something bad is happening up there. The king set aside this armor for the champion who defeated Angoff. It was a treasure of Daggerfall, and now it belongs to you. It's your reward for all you've done for this land and its people. May luck follow you wherever you go. Sir! Sir, I... They took him, sir. 